Welcome back to the Electricians 2 channel. Uh, we're going to do a review, a uh, short review of my new, newly purchased, purchased uh, Ideal Industries voltage detector. Uh, it's not like I needed another voltage detector, but I, because I have so many of them. But uh, I, you know, they kind of, I, I, I'm not going to say they're worn or anything like that, but uh, when you're dealing with electrical, you, you guys who are electricians, you know, you want to keep your tools kind of up to date, especially when they have uh, maybe different features that you can use or uh, different safety uh, measures been installed in them or something like that. But anyway, uh, this is brand, brand new. I had it now for about maybe three, about two days, two days now, three days. And I thought I'd do a short review. Uh, before we get started, guys, always I'm gonna ask you if this is your first time watching this station. I mean this channel, <laughs> watching this channel. Uh, and if you and if you like the channel, man, I'm asking that you help support the channel, and you can do that by leaving a comment, hitting the subscribe button, and uh, or uh, hitting the like button, sharing the sharing the video. All that does is just you know just just help support the channel, and it's for free. Uh, I'll repeat that it's for free. You're just supporting the channel. So we're going to do a short review and uh, just call out some of the features that um, this detector have and, you know, compare it to the others and uh, give my likes and dislikes about it. Okay. Uh, okay. This is Ideal Industry Voltage Detector, model number uh, 61-657. Um, it's a dual range, 12 to 1,000 volt AC, non-contact uh, voltage detector, uh, a voltage tester with flashlight. Uh, they have, it's, let me see what else they have in here besides that. Comes with a little, I guess it, this is a little manual. It tells you how to operate just in case. You know, it's kind of like if you looking at it, if you've dealt with them before, you kind of know your way around them. I know I do. They may have some sense, some some uh, hidden features that I don't know about. That's why I may have to get into that and see. But according to but looking on the side, reading this on the side, it says a voltage detector, sensitivity range 12 to 1,000 volts AC, 50, uh, 50 to 1,000 volts um, AC. It says um, it's rated IP, IP67. Cat four, uh, one thousand volts, and here in the front they have. Uh, if we turn it on, I'm gonna just turn it on for you guys. You turn it on. Now, it's it's it's, it's lit up red right here in the bottom. In red, yo, that what stands for. Right now, it's in fifty to one thousand volt range. If I press it again, it turns blue. So that's low voltage. And that'll be from 12 volts to a thousand volt range. It also has a flashlight. I had turned it off earlier to, uh, I was just checking it out. It wasn't as bright as I thought it would be, you know, but let me just turn it on that you guys see. You know, I mean, it'll, it'll, it'll work in a, you know, in a, in a hot minute, it'll work if you need it. It'll, it'll be something that's helpful, very helpful. And it's not, it's not bad. I mean, don't get me wrong. It's not, it's not real bad, but it's, you know, it's helpful. It's, it's helpful. Uh, you can just click it on and off, and you can also just click this off by pressing it and holding the uh, the on button and then to turn it off. Now, it's it's kind of bigger than the rest. You know, it's, it's much thicker than the rest of the, uh, the, the normal ones that you used to see out there. Um, it's kind of bulky, do, and I don't know if it would take a drop or not um, I, I mean maybe it would but I wouldn't want to chance it it's made in China according to this it's made in China and they they have a little grip right here um, the little rubber grip to hold it you can also hold it around the sides and there's a clip there's a clip right here for either your belt or your um, your shirt pocket turn it off it takes two AAA batteries which goes in the back of here the top of here Take that off, and there you have it. Two AAA batteries. Um, you know, I mean, I'm, I'm, I don't have anything bad to say about it. It's a voltage detector. 
and um, so far I'm I'm liking it. I wish I could have. I wish it had a pouch that goes with this, that a belt loop, uh, because I would hate to carry something around this big in my shirt pocket, you know, my in front of my shirt pocket. Um, but I don't, or, or I, and I wouldn't carry it around in, in a case. So um, I guess you have to make a find a spot in your tool box. I mean tool pouch for it. But um, I like it. I like it. I'll find something um, to put it in. I had an old flashlight. Those of you who remember the old mag lights, need to come in this pouch here. It's too big for that. So don't even think about that. It won't, it won't even fit. It won't even put the tip of it in there. So too, it's too, too bulky for it. But other than that, man, it's a real good flashlight. I mean, a real good uh, tester. Um, I'm going to see how, see how sensitive it is. I got this little, uh, my phone cord here, uh, my, uh, my cord for my cordless phone right here. And I'm going to see if it will pick that up. I'm going to put it on low. Let me see. It's low voltage. Yep, it picks it up. And that's for my, and uh, that's for this phone right here. So, but it's picking it up. Okay. But let me see if it'll do the same for 50 volts. Uh, and it's on fifth on 52, um, 52 1000 volts. Okay, so it's 120 volts we know coming through here. So okay, yeah, it's supposed to pick that up. Right, because. Uh, from 12 to 1,000 volts going to pick it up. From 50, that's right. That's right. But, yeah, it's a pretty decent little tester. Um, I don't, it comes with a, calib a certificate of calibration. Let me see. Yeah. And um, that's about it. There's not much to say about it. But um, I'm, I'm pleased with it. I'm pleased. Um, so, anyway, guys, I want to I wanna thank you for watching. Um, I'll be back with more videos. Just stay tuned. Um, so until next time, you guys take care. And as always, peace out.